This is strictlyhiphop.com. I am Mrs. Jaida, and I'm in the presence of a triple threat today. This guy's an actor, a model, a songwriter, and he's an artist himself. I'm talking about Christ Young. How you doing, baby? What's good? What's good? How you? How Thanks you for doing? having me. No problem. Tell me about how you got your start into the acting industry. All right, well, with the acting industry, um, I was actually cool. I don't really like name drop, but I was cool with one of my peoples. You know, he's an actor, mm -hmm. you know, got a few decent roles, you know, doing his thing. And um, at the time when I started acting, this was probably like around 2000. How was it when you're auditioning for these things? you just super confident? I just go, yeah. I just confidence go is key. I go in with confidence and I know my lines. That's Simple it. Simple as that. Knowing your lines. That's Cause I, one thing I love about auditioning, like when I audition, mm -hmm. I always make sure I know my lines. Have I don't to. care if they gave, I don't care if they gave me the script an hour ago. I'm gonna know them three pages. I'm gonna memorize them word for word. And it's just all about your training. Like I train, I'm an acting coach, and it's like I have memorization techniques. So. If you gave it to me last week, if you gave it to me an hour ago, I'ma know my lines. I never walk into the producers without knowing my lines. So yeah, you can't what, be sloppy like that. You know why? Because when I walk in an audition, not to sound cocky or nothing, I already know who's my competition, who ain't my competition. From the first glance, glance. two minutes, I know who my competition. First of all, you walking in the audition with your script in your hand, I already know I got you. Yeah. Because everybody walking in, da 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 da. Well, I don't think that we should do that. <laughs> when I walk in, the first thing they say, where's your script? It's right here. That right there oh, get wow. their attention. Uh -huh. that, that, that right, it's all about standing out with acting. It sure you is. You have to do something. I remember one time, Tiana Smalls. I didn't even get the role. Shout out to Tiana Smalls, though. Mm -hmm. I didn't even get the role. I auditioned for her. She joked on me, clowned on me. She was like, Yo, you better not mess up your lines. You don't got your script. We just gave out the lines today. And you know what's so funny? I knew all my lines. And when I left, I saw one of my peoples. He was a, he's an actor. He auditioned. We was outside chopping it up. The person that auditioned after me was like, yo, they were still talking about you after you left. They couldn't believe that you knew the lines that quick. Oh, you got to do something. And I didn't even get the line. But I guess, I mean, I didn't get the role. But I guess sometimes you even though you do good, though. sometimes you do good, but they already know they look. They already know kind of what they want what sometimes. Mm -hmm. So it, it is what it is. No hard I remember the first time I did Law & Order, man. Yeah, oh, that's man. Good. It was crazy. I was eating lunch with iced tea in them. Like, it wow. was crazy. I was eating steak with iced tea in them. Like, yo, I remember mm -hmm. one time I got in trouble, right? And I was locked up. And I was watching Law & Order on TV to actually watch that in jail. And then you come home, you, you're actually on Law & Order. Like, that's like that shows you God is good. Mm. And you can turn a negative to a positive. And the streets ain't what it is. So if you're stuck in the street right now, anybody that's watching, you know, you can always find your way out. You might not be an actor, rapper, a ball player, but you can find your lane, own a business. You could do something. The streets ain't what it is no more. So I'm a prime example how you can be in a situation and just turn your life around. So it's possible. We out here. Mm, that's very right. So as for the music, what do you plan on? Do you have, all right, because being that you're an actor and you're a musician, do you have, you, which one do you take more serious? The lines don't ever get blurred on what you want to do? I mean, music is different because music, I do it in my sleep. Like music. Music comes more. Natural. I mean, acting, I, I think I, I'm really good at acting too, but music is just, I do that in my sleep. When I tell you in my sleep, I can wake up in the middle of the night, write a song, and go back to sleep. Like, yeah. really, like, like I'm like I'm crazy. Like, really, like, <laughs> music the, is nothing. Like, that's nothing to me. I do it for the sport. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But acting, I love being different people. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I love becoming somebody else. I Would you shoot for a record deal? Like, is that how serious you want to take it? I'm trying to see how serious you want to take the, the music it ain't really about the record deal no more it's all about your cosign now you're right you don't need a deal no more you don't you, you, do you a could song stay independent and be you do a song and cash out you, you on like, well the right song the right song the right, right period of time right, strictlyhiphop.com all that that's and, right and you pop off mm -hmm. the modeling you really have been in a lot of fashion shows a lot of modeling work you've done tell me about that I got, I got some models just networking. You have a passion for fashion, is that it? Yeah, I love, mm -hmm. I mean, 
I mean, I'm a, I'm I mean a look dude. at you. I throw a little special <laughs> some J's. I, I mean, J's is like my uniform. I go to Flight Club, mm-hmm. cash out for some good J's. Because I don't like wearing J's that everybody got. See, everybody was wearing the, the these joints that came out, but they had the blue. Mm-hmm. So I said, like, you know what? I don't want to wear it. I, don't, I hate looking down, and everybody got what I got on. Yeah. Like, I hate that. I so see I said, a hat says different. You, you trying to be different. <laughs> yeah, I rocked with you for that one. <laughs> but I said, everybody got the blue tongue, no matter the red tongue. The red, the, the, the mm-hmm. originals out. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Bring them out. I just don't like looking like everybody else. Yeah, that's Bring understandable. Yeah. Facts. So you just got, so you, did you kind of fall into the modeling? Or was you recruited? People, no, no. Yeah, da, you doing this, you doing that. Just come. Have you ever tried this? No. But ah. Uh, if somebody bring an opportunity, I ain't gonna act like. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I did that before. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, I, yeah. I might lie. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Fake yeah. it. And that's how it happened. Well. You learn as you go sometimes. Exactly. You know what I mean? that's, 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 what you, that's exactly what you have to do. You was on an opportunity. So I'm like, nah, I never did that. Oh, wow. Well, I'm gonna go get somebody who, who did it. Exactly. That's dumb. I'm from the hood. Mm-hmm. We're, gonna, we're gonna work something. I'm gonna learn. Tell them where they can find you at, all your social networks and everything. All right, y'all can follow me on that Instagram, Christ Young NYC, C H R Y S T Young NYC. Same thing for my Twitter. Uh, I don't really be on Facebook like that, but y'all can still follow me on Facebook too, Christ Young. Um, y'all can go to my website, www.christyoung.com. Uh, check out my reality series, Day in the Life of Christ, www.sweet929.tv. That's S U I T E 929.tv. Uh, Christyoungblogspot.com. Yeah, 